complexity theory is the field that tries to classify problems by the inherent resources needed to solve them. How much time, how much memory, how much randomness, or quantum computing resources. P and NP are two of the most basic classes that we study. We care not just about the raw number of steps, but typically about the scaling behavior. As you go to larger and larger inputs, at what rate is the number of steps that you need increasing? Often the gold standard is linear scaling, which would mean when your input is twice as large, then your algorithm takes twice as long, right? We also often encounter quadratic time, which would mean the number of steps grows like the input size squared. It would mean if you have twice as much data to process, then your algorithm will take four times as long. These are pretty reasonable scaling rates. What we don't like is exponential scaling, which would mean you need a number of steps that grows like two to the power of the number of input bits or something like that. Because then even if you had just a thousand input bits, which is not very many, you would be talking about two to the thousand steps, which is much, much more than the number of atoms in the observable universe.